Wow, perfect. I've been working hours to finish decorating this cupcake to perfection. Oh, oh no, I see a little spot right there. My perfect masterpiece isn't so perfect anymore. Do you have any times before where you've worked so hard to get everything to be perfect and then in the end you still see a spot, a mistake, or a way you could have done it better? It's impossible for us to be perfect. God is so good, but we're not. Since sin came into the world, we all have mistakes. Have you ever disobeyed your parents before? Did you get punished? I would think you probably did. Maybe they took away something fun that you had for a little while. If you ever lie to your parents or disrespect them, you might even get disciplined. But even though you did something wrong and you disrespected your parents, did they all of a sudden stop loving you? Of course not. This same idea applies to God as well, except for one big difference. Your parents aren't perfect too. God is. Join me today as we continue our journey through the book of Psalms and find more about the goodness of God. I see the evidence of your goodness all over my life, all over my life. I see your promises in fulfillment all over Psalm 30 verse 5 says, For his anger lasts only a moment, but his favor lasts a lifetime. Weeping may last through the night, but joy comes with the morning. You may have heard the word sin. Sin is anything we say, do, or think that displeases or goes against God. We are all sinners. We've all done things that displease God. Even your parents have sinned. There is a verse in the Bible that says, everyone has sinned and we all fall short of God's glorious standard. God's standard is perfection. Everyone falls short of that standard. And when we sin, it disappoints God. He might even discipline us because of our sin. He does that because he loves us and he wants us to live lives that honor him. Our verse today tells us that God's anger doesn't last forever. What else does this verse tell us? It tells us that yes, God gets angry when we sin. He gets angry when we do things that are against him, what he wants us to do. But that anger doesn't last forever. And he promises us great joy and favor that lasts a lifetime. The joy that God gives us is far superior to anything we can get from this world. The pleasures of this world will fade. They cannot and will not last forever. Clothes will fade. Movies and video games will get old and boring. Trophies will be stored away and forgotten. But God's everlasting love will never end. He will never fade away. It will never get too old or boring. God brings us joy. God is good and he is perfect. Remember this week that God is perfect and he is the only one that brings us joy and lasts forever.